Hi, I'm Jerome Gibson. Here I am in the bathtub again. Today I want to show you how we're going to take this shower head off. What I've done is I've got one with a nice 72 inch hose. Most of them only have 60 inch hoses or less, but this one's got 72s. That's what I got. So it's got its own head. It's got the connector here that replaces this. And they've gave me a couple of washers. And so what we're going to do is put it on. Now, the first thing is that this is on here really tight and I don't have a pipe wrench. Anybody that's done any canning and messed around with trying to get a, the lid off a jar, I'm going to use the same thing, a rubber band. Then I'm going to put this rubber band on here, right on the threads of the old one. And then I'm going to try and twist it off. Yeah, there we go. Easy as pie. Oh. Guess it had a little water inside there, but that's okay. And I'm going to hang on to that because whether you own the place or whether you rent the place, if you ever want to put the old one back, you have it. And all you have to do is unscrew this one the same way and put it back on and take the long one and you can move it to wherever you want to go. So when you put these on, it's going to go this way. So when we put the Teflon tape on, we're going to go the same. We're going to go the same way as the threads are so that if the threads cut into it, it won't peel it off. It'll be cutting into it the way it's supposed to go. And by putting the tape on, it'll make sure it doesn't leak. And we probably won't need a pipe wrench when we uh, come back to put it back on. What we need to do first, we need to put a washer inside this portion here that's going to replace that. So I got the washer in there, and all I'm going to do is, well, I think all I'm going to do is turn it and go reverse for a minute to make sure it's Threading okay. I want to be really careful with this because most of these pieces are plastic now. It's important to get it to thread straight. There we are. Now I'm going to get that rubber band and I'm going to tighten it up a little bit because it's pretty slippery. That's the problem. It's, it's not that it's that tight. It's just slippery and you can't grip it. So I'll put a rubber band on it and try that again so we can get it. Okay. That feels pretty good. I'll leave it on there until I'm dead. I don't need that rubber band, so in the end I might take a pair of scissors and cut it off. Okay, that's part one. We'll put the hose on. I'm a typical guy, okay? So I didn't read the instructions. But we've got more washers. They've generously supplied us with three washers, which is probably what we're going to need. One to go in here, one to go on either end of the hose. Wherever there's a connection, you should have a rubber washer. Just to make sure it doesn't leak, I'll put some Teflon tape on this as well. Always go in the same direction as the thread. I'm only going to go around once or twice. That's enough. This is the end I put the uh, washer in. That's nice and tight. Okay. Now we've got one more washer. Okay, we put the washer in. If you look at the end, you can see which direction the thread is turning. And it turns this way. So I'll put some Teflon tape on there. There we are. Should be enough. Done. Now is that easy or what? Okay, we'll turn some water on. <laughs> Look at that. Supposed to have some little device here to change the um, to change the flow. Ah, yeah. It's a wonderful thing. Okay. I don't need that. Oh. Oh, check for leak. Ah, this is not tight enough up here. Maybe I'll grab a towel. The rubber's a little slippery now. It's going to get a little tighter still. Then. That's the way it's going to be. You're just having a regular shower. It'll sit there. But the main reason I wanted to replace this is because I want to show you a new way, a better way, a simpler way to clean this shower stall and the tub. I'd even let it go so it could get nice and dirty in order to show how we're going to do this. And uh, the next project is a simpler way and faster way to clean the bathtub. So there.